Good morning or afternoon or evening everyone and welcome back to another vlog. I started off my morning doing an Abraham Hicks morning meditation. I started doing it last week and it has seriously left me feeling so motivated and positive and ready to start my day. I couldn't recommend it enough and then I did some yoga. I like to do yoga and stretch every morning and I also did a little bit of a mad fit ab workout. I also like to try and do those every day and just get myself moving, get my blood flowing. I actually usually do an Ashtanga practice but my body has really changed in the last year I would say and everything's gotten like really tight. I spent a winter here for the first time in a while last year and it was really cold and it really felt like the cold just got into my joints and all my bones and since then my legs have been feeling super achy and then when I was living in Cayman I was cycling everywhere and I was not doing enough yoga for sure because I was working so much so my legs have gotten so tight and I haven't been doing a shang every day I've just kind of felt good just stretching so I do my shanga practice maybe once a week, my full practice. I go to the shala and I do it. It's nice to be around other people. It gives me the energy to do my full practice. But now I'm just doing some journaling. I'm in a Instagram challenge group thing where we do 22 minutes of meditation and then we do two pages of journaling. And I used to journal every day and I haven't been journaling every day. So I thought this would be a good way to do it. So I'm doing two pages every day and I've been finding myself having a hard time to fill up those two pages, but we're three days in. So hopefully that'll get a little bit better and easier for me. I'm just finishing off my journaling for the morning and then I'm gonna have some fruit and get my day started. now and I had to wash my hair because it was on its like last legs and I didn't have much time so I just styled it with my Denman and I mean my bangs are a little out of control but otherwise I think it looks pretty good for doing it in like under an hour maybe yeah I'm going downtown with my mom and my grandma now we're going to get some fabric to make a dress for a wedding that I'm going to and I've been trying to get all of my clothes, either second hand or from like ethical or sustainable shops. And I haven't found any dresses that I like. So I'm gonna make one. Well, not me, my mom and my grandma are gonna make one for me. Just putting on some Living Libation sunscreen and their best skin ever oil on my face burn easily and I like to pick up my skin at all times. Let's go eat. Miss 
the food? You missed the food, you're too late. I'll give you a blueberry. You wanna go get a blueberry? Ginger has an ear infection, which is why her ear is all greasy and sad. You also can't tell where sound is coming from, so you talk to her and she looks in like the opposite direction. <laughs> hey, sweetie. Do you wanna go get a treat? Over here, I'm over here. Do you wanna go get a treat? Do ya? You wanna go get a treat? Do ya? I love that my hair always looks way better on camera than it does in person. <laughs> Perks of having curly hair. I'm waiting for Stern and we are headed to yoga because it's Saturday and then I think I'm going downtown again. But yesterday we went downtown and I got a dress. I got fabric for my dress. Then we ordered pizza from Whole Foods, which if you haven't had pizza from Whole Foods, it's so good. It's gigantic and the buffalo cauliflower mushroom vegan pizza is where it's at. What's up, punk? What's up, punk? <gasps> Hello. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. almost two months ago. <laughs> Originally, the shipping company lost my package. It took 30 days and then I contacted them and I told them that my package had not made any movements. So they resent me another one and I finally got it in. I'm gonna show you what I got. I have really, really bad cramps. So I am trying to do a couple different things to help out. So from her, I got two of the flow balances and one of the liver juices and with this package came this little wellness lookbook and look at how cute she is she's so pretty she recently did a post on her instagram stories with all of the information about where she sources all of her herbs and stuff from and just really really good stuff and it is all non-gmo and vegan for the liver juice it says an herbal tincture designed to optimize liver function and support detoxification pathways that can be used as a cleanse or daily detox plus hormone support and then i got the flow balance which is a balancing and regulating formula designed to optimize hormone health and promote the relief of pms symptoms that is what I need. So let's try it out. I'm kind of nervous that it's gonna taste really bad, so you know, good for you, but it might not taste good. This is what I saw Olivia do. She poured some water. I'm sorry, it's so dark in here. It's raining outside. So she took a dropper full of one and put it into a glass. Low balance. Now that I have water all over the place, cheers. Oh, uh-huh, wow. I'm glad I put that in water. I can do that. 
it's definitely not my favorite thing, but it's good for you, so. And I also went to the bookstore and picked up Rich Dad Poor Dad, and I already started it, and it is so good. I've heard amazing things about it. And I started that, and then I also ordered how to win friends and influence people into the store, so that should also be coming in, but so far, already starting this one, I love it. It's just an entertaining read. It's not like a boring finance book. He tells a story from his life, and it starts off as him as like a nine-year-old kid learning from his friend's dad on how to save money and all that kind of stuff. So, highly recommend that. I think I'm gonna end this video off here, but if you are new here, my name is Sarah. Hello and welcome. It is nice to meet you. I make videos every week, so hopefully I will see you in my next video. Bye.